Hey, hey, Crowd Vibers. This is season one, episode 26 of Crowd Vibes Clips for the week of April 29th. Wow, April's coming to a close, but we've got plenty of music happening in our lives and plenty of shows on the concert calendar, so let's jump right in. We had a double header this past Saturday. First up was Sons of Paradise playing at Brugaloo NC Craft Beer Festival. What an interesting scene. Then later that evening, we saw Signal Fire with Operation Culture playing at the Poorhouse Music Hall. Both shows were a blast, and I'll be working on those video clips soon, but we got a lot of stuff in front of it. Coming up this week on the channel, two of my favorite sets from Florida Groves. On Tuesday, April 29th, we've got The Elevators playing their sunset session in a lovely shaded pavilion. Let me just say I've never experienced what I did at the end of their set before. If I remember correctly, they ended with about four minutes uh, to go, and the crowd was really into it. They were doing soccer chants. Then the cheerful sound for an encore started to get a little feisty when the crowd realized there was no encore on the way and the announcer guy was booed. On a brighter note, it was a pretty dope set. So I think I'll need to give a little more of the full story on that in a later video, so maybe later this week. Then uh, on Friday, May 3rd, my favorite set from Saturday at Florida Groves will be highlighting Tribal Seeds. I don't know if it's because I've been listening to their new album, Ancient Blood, on repeat and on repeat and on repeat, but I was really into this set, and I hope you enjoy it too. Last week, we featured Fortunate Youth and Claire Wright from Reggae Rise Up. Be sure to check out those clips, including Claire Wright doing some really cool stuff on the Sugar Shack stage. Bonus alert! On Saturday night, I ran a really cool experiment on the channel, and I released all of my video clips from the Bumpin' Uglies, Dale and the Z-Dubs, and Joint Operation Show in Richmond, Virginia. Those are off to a great start, so thanks everyone for tuning in. Looking ahead at the concert calendar, April has been really busy, and May is no different. On Thursday, May 2nd, Mike Pinto and Rockstead are playing at Bowstring Brewyard in Raleigh. On Friday, May 3rd, Tribal Seeds is playing in Myrtle Beach. Then on Saturday, May 4th, they'll be in Charleston, South Carolina. We're eyeing the Saturday show because we're going to have a bunch of teenagers in our pool on Friday afternoon. It'll actually be pretty cool, so I'm not too worried about it. On Sunday, May 5th, Lua Flora is in Pittsburgh, North Carolina. This one just came across my desk, so I'm still looking into that show. On Thursday, May 9th, we're seeing the Sum 41 Farewell Tour with the Interrupters at Red Hat Amphitheater in downtown Raleigh. And on Friday, May 10th, Joey Harkum will be at Bowstring Brew Yard. And same day in downtown Raleigh, Bumpin' Uglies and Treehouse will be at the Poor House Music Hall. And the Ugly Show will probably sell out. When we were at the Poor House this weekend, the show already had a low ticket warning on the poster. And don't forget, Mother's Day is coming up too. Well, that's it for this week, y'all. If you like the crowd vibes, smash the likes button, share your favorite videos, and subscribe to get alerts for new stuff. Thanks, y'all. Enjoy the crowd vibes.